Hi, nice to meet you. My name is Nash. How you doing? I'm doing good, baby. How you doing? <laughs> No, 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 no! What, what is that? Please subscribe Nash Robotics. Hello Humanites, welcome to Hash Robotics. This is Hari Shankar. In last video, we have seen how to add facial expression and voice to the robot using ESP32. Now, in this video, we are going to add some body movements to the robot. If you did not watch previous video, please watch without skipping because I am going to follow the same steps here also. If you did not subscribe yet, please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for instant notification. If you have any doubts, please ask me in the comments. Let's see how it's done. This is the circuit diagram. We are just going to connect PCA9685 to ESP32. The OLED display and PCA9685 are controlled by I2C communication. That is, ESP32 will act as master and OLED display and PCA9685 will act as slaves. We are going to use the same circuit connection which was used in the previous video. In addition to that, we are going to connect PCA9685 servo drive to the existing circuit. Add ESP32 board manager and record libraries. The board manager URL for ESP32 available in the description.
I am going to follow the same steps to convert WAV file to export format and bitmap format for OLED display. Please refer previous video for more details. Hello humanoids. My name is Hash. Hello, humanoid.
select the board proper setting port and upload the program if you are facing any issue while uploading press the boot button for 2 to 3 seconds and release it As you can see the program has been uploaded please enjoy the video and see you in the next one